Hello, Hoover High students. This is uh, Mr. Heron, your Fresno City College stats instructor. And um, really, Miss Oliva is the one that's uh, helping you the most. But anyway, I'm checking in with you. Happy week 14. I hope you're doing well, had a good weekend, and things are going well for you. I just wanted to share a couple things about um, a course with you. Wait, where's where did my course go? There it goes. All right. Yeah. So you're seeing, so you're seeing my screen and just a couple things here. And we, we, this is week 14, which by the way, means we only have about uh, three weeks to go and the semester's over for us. Um, we probably end a little earlier than uh, you all do at Hoover high, but we're going to wrap things up. Our final exam is scheduled for the week of uh, May 13th. So that'll be the end of the course. So anyway, we, uh, what do we have? We have next week, we have exam four. I'm going to open up exam four over several days, part one, part two, just like I did for the other exams. Hope that's working well for you. Um, so yeah, so next week we have um, we have exam four. And um, then after that, we just have a little bit of getting ready for the final. And then the final will be, like I said, the week of May 13th. That's where we're at. I'd be glad to help on Zoom with anything. I know you got Miss Oliva, who is excellent, helping you with everything there. Looks like everybody's passing the course. I'm super glad to see that. I'd love to see you all get A's and B's. Um, I think we're close to that. So um, yeah, so that's about all. I hope you're using the notes, right? The, yeah, this next, let me say a couple words about the next exam. Exam four is all about identification. The The, the steps are not too bad. The, the online calculator does the heavy lifting, right? Does the work. But it's about being able to recognize what kind of a question it is, because we have lots of different techniques now, right? Well, that's where the notebook, you guys know the notes, right? Miss Oliva, I think, copies those. Right? Here's the notes right on the homepage. You can click there and print it. But I think Miss Oliva already got that for you. Here it is. Here's the unit four notes. So you need to read the things at the top here. So here's two proportions, two independent. I mean, especially these first two pages, two dependent. Sound like, what's dependent? says right here, data is matched in pairs, actor, actress, male, female, before, after, with, without. So, you know, you learn to recognize the different kinds. Down here, you know, goodness of fit and uh, homogeneity. I thought, oh, you haven't got to homogeneity yet. Or, or you're doing that right now. You're doing that right now. Homogeneity, right? Um, so it's learning to recognize it. Now, it's all, the trick is it's always easy when you're in the homework, right? Because in the homework... We just do the same thing again and again and again and again. So you can kind of fool yourself and think, oh, yeah, I got it. Well, you're just using the same online calculator 10 times in a row, so no problem. Well, the trick is on the exam, they're all mixed together, and they don't say, hint, this is from section 10.3 or 11.1 or 11.2. And so you need to learn to recognize. That's what the practice exam number four is all about is helping you recognize, oh, when I see these words, it's this type. When I see those words, it's this other type. So you really need to practice that. Spend some good time, especially on practice exam four next week. But even now, as you're looking at the homework, make sure you're asking yourself, how would I recognize this? How's this different? Look back to the last homework and say, how's this different than the, how am I going to know it's this type and not that type we did last week or yesterday or whatever? That's the key to exam number four. All right. I hope you're doing well. I'd be glad to help with anything. Miss Oliva, I'm sure, is helping you a ton. All right, guys. I hope you have a good week. I'll talk to you later.